The search for a missing swimmer has ended tonight, and it's not the way that rescuers were hoping. They found his body just in the past few hours in Lake George. That's on the edge of Volusia and Lake counties north of Astor. After he swam away from his boat with his girlfriend, she made it back. He did not. News 6 Troy Campbell is there live tonight. Troy. Eric, investigators say the man's body was pulled from Lake George just after 7 o'clock tonight. We've also learned that the boat he was in entered the water right here behind us for what was supposed to be a celebration for the extended weekend. Pleasure cruising, recreational, uh, enjoying the holiday weekend, Labor Day weekend, so it's not uncommon for them to be where they were. This Lake County Sheriff's Office search boat out of the water near Lake George after about a four hour search. Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission says the male victim was swimming near the group's boat, but didn't make it back on board. They were swimming, became fatigued, returning to the boat, and uh, she was able to make it. and. Uh, that was the last time they saw him. FWC says the group's boat launched here at the Butler Street boat ramp earlier today. The search for the man limited because of the weather conditions near the lake. We weren't able to get a county helicopter up just because we had a lot of rain, a lot of wind in the area. So uh, we called in the Coast Guard um, to help us. They, and we utilize all the equipment from these different agencies to uh, try to locate this gentleman. This group of people seen consoling each other next to the sheriff's office command post shortly after they announced the man's body had been recovered. This is not the outcome that we never want this outcome. Um, we want everybody to come out, enjoy the waterways and enjoy a good holiday weekend and go home safe. Um, this is not the outcome we ever want. FWC also adds at this point it's unclear if that man drowned or if he was attacked by a gator and they add there is a large gator population in these area waters. They've also have not released the victim's identity. Eric. Sad to hear either way, Troy. Thank you.